How organisations are working with agencies has changed dramatically. It's one of the reasons that we started Create Future, because we didn't think that the needs of senior marketeers were being met by agencies and consultancies. A number of different models have emerged. So you've got your traditional model, which is external, so you're outsourcing everything. You've got an in-house model, where you're bringing agency team members into your business, um, either in an integrated way, or actually the agency is providing you a dedicated agency that sits within your business. There is an in-house model, so clients actually building out their own teams and internal capability, or there is a hybrid model. We've often got a little bit of all of the above. There's been a definite swing to in-house, so bringing you know, agency staff into, into the business. Um, so companies like Oliver or Wonderman Inside have been leading the charge on this. At Create Future, we believe in working on site alongside our clients, augmenting them and helping them to deliver the work that they're delivering as in-house teams. So why this trend? What are the benefits of it? A study by the ISBA showed, um, this is the view of CMOs, that they felt that you know, 86% of CMOs felt that having an in-house model provided them with greater speed and agility, compared with only 23% like um, for an outsourced model. Other benefits included better collaboration, operational control, transparency, and lower cost. So that all sounds great. Um, and for us, it fits with our principles of working in a fun, fast, and collaborative way. There are pitfalls. Um, I don't have time to talk about my view on those. Um, I will, they'll be in my blog, which supports this video. Um, so if you are um, a brand that is working in a slightly different way with your agencies, it would be great to hear what you think. How have you changed what you're doing? Um, and how do we all think that things are going to evolve over the next few years? Because whilst there's been a swing, I'm pretty sure that we're going to see um, maybe some of the, the, the pitfalls of that playing out over the next couple of years.